what to do after college? Some UH football players and Wahine basketball players got a chance to hear about some possible career opportunities in the hospitality industry. KITV4 photojournalist Paul Omenkar takes us today's event, which was emceed by KITV4's Diana Ko. Uh, the way the job is to time it so that the next course, maybe it's the entree, which takes about 10 minutes to pull. We have launched our Ready Gazette program. It's been about 18 months now. Within the 18 months, we have definitely expanded our program to reach out to DOE. We're giving back to the Keikis of Hawaii, preparing them for a job opportunity here in Hawaii. We want to make sure that the students clearly understand that there are definitely a lot of work opportunities within the state that could sustain them where they do not feel like they have to relocate to another state because of inflation, because of um, the cost it is to live in paradise. How has Sisterhood Grinds helped you in general? Um, I mean, providing us with connections, like especially with like food last summer that we had, um, was a big help. Specifically this year, like being able to meet with new people and kind of like broadening what we want to do. Because I know I'm a senior, I didn't really know what I want to do. So I think of, like, um, there is definitely uh, misinformation. I be strongly believe that in tourism and hospitality, there is definitely a demand. There's definitely um, jobs available where they could support their families. As far as wages, as far as benefits, it can definitely sustain and allow them to buy a house or support their family in Hawaii without needing to move out of the state.